Around eight to nine weeks ago, this happened. Knowing that I could not squat or deadlift, I decided to focus on the last remaining lift of the big three that I could do, the bench press. My bench press has always been weaker compared to my squat and deadlift and since I could not do them, I was going to bring that bench right up. Then this happened. This was a massive goal of mine for a long time. After that I put in more work, time and attention and this happened on Christmas Day. This is amazing, going from not being able to do 100kg for one rep to doing it for a pause, then a few weeks later 110kg for a tap and go. After all that I put in 10 weeks of hard work and went for a new paused PR. This is how it went. What's going on guys, Scott Dean, Power Build Fitness here and I hope you've enjoyed the start of this video. Um, I thought I'd mix it up and do uh, something a little bit different, uh, try out more editing skills and stuff like that so I hope you've really enjoyed that. So let's go ahead and get on to the PR. So um, I came into this workout not really knowing what I wanted to do. And um, I was kind of hemming and hawing on whether to go for a new tap and go or a new pause. And I realised how long it's been actually since I've tried uh, a new pause bench. And I knew I'd been putting in a lot of work since then. So I knew uh, I'd be able to hit something new. I wasn't aware of what I'd be able to hit. And what I did hit actually amazed me and stunned me. So what you're seeing here is I'm just warming up here with 60 kilo either side. How I warm up on the benches, I do three sets with the bar, uh, 8 to 12 reps, somewhere in around there, tap and go, mix the tap and go and pause, and I warm up with my bands and stuff like that, and do uh, shoulder mobility and stuff like that. I also stretch uh, my hips, my quads and stuff like that, it allows me to get my feet more under me and get better of an arch. So from there, uh, I done one set of 60 kilo, from there I went straight to 80 kilo, as you see here, for I believe three or four reps or five, somewhere in around there. I'll just pause to get used to it and um, I'm leaving all these clips raw as you can see here and um, just to let you know from there I went to 90 kilo for a double I believe or a single and um, let's go ahead and check here what I actually done because I actually I can't really remember and um, my uh, boy there Aaron in the background helped me out I'm pretty sure this was at the end of his workout and he stayed a bit extra just to give me a hand there so shout out to Aaron thanks very much always pushing me in the gym and uh, helping me out so yeah, I believe I done 90 kilo for a double pause there just to get warm. And from there, I believe I went 97 and a half kilo. So this is 97 and a half kilo. Didn't want to go directly to the 100 uh, to save energy. So I just done 97 and a half for a single pause. And now this is my brother in the background who was also uh, there that day giving me a hand um, in between doing his sets as well and stuff like that. So uh, shout out to my brother, always in the gym as well always helping me and pushing me and the two of them uh, got me through this workout today so uh, credit to them for always being there and always motivating me so as I said 97 and a half for a single there that was nice and easy and from there I went I went on to uh, 105 kilo so um, if you see in a video a while ago uh, when I tested all my maxes I went to do 105 and I nearly got it and the guy pulled the bar off me so I went and I goes, do you know what, I'll do 105 for a pause today and if I get that I'll be really happy. And what you'll actually see here is I done 105 and it went really, really smooth and really well. Um, pause was, it was okay. Um, I'm never really happy with the way my pauses go um, uh, on heavier weight. I always liked them on the lighter weight and I don't know, um, it was alright but, you know, I'll uh, take it. Uh, from there we moved on to 107.5 kilo and this was this was in my head I was like if I get this wow this is a 7.5 kilo uh, PR like I've gone up 7.5 kilo on my pause bench this is it's actually amazing like how good would it be just just to get this 
and I, I was really determined to get this and I was just like, do you know what, I'm, I'm going to get this, I'm definitely going to get this and as you'll see here now in a second, I get it and it's really, really smooth. Uh, on video it actually looks easier than it felt. Um, normally it's the opposite way around, it feels hard and then you look back on video, it's like, oh no, that was actually really easy. But uh, yeah, as you can see here, 107 kilo or 107.5 kilo, sorry for a pause, nice pause there. Um, I have a tendency to, uh, to sink, but yeah. I held it at the top and went back so from there we moved on to 110 kilo and uh, I was if I had got this I was going to be just absolutely astounded so I'm gonna go ahead here uh, shut up and um, let's just watch the raw clip and I'll talk to you in a few seconds guys so I'll see you in a bit There goes the dynamite. So I uh, got that 110 kilo pause bench, guys. 110 kilo at my age and my weight is just ridiculous. Well, for my standards, that's just ridiculous. And I know you're going to say, oh, yeah, um, struggled up. But everything, like it was a struggle, but I grinded it and it was competition style. My brother said, start. I started when it came down and the bar was stopped moving. He said, press pressed held it at the top until he said rack and that was just absolutely amazing so what you're seeing here guys is i then proceeded uh, to go for a one rep with the with the band so i put on 120 kilo and um, dropped it a bit too fast there struggled with it but got it up so yeah with the band 120 kilo paused is my new um new one rep with that so yeah one rep with the new band 120 kilo from there i went mad for some reason and put on 125 uh, i should have only bumped it up 2.5 kilo but i went up five kilo and I, with the band for a new one rep and as you'll see here i didn't get it so guys i just want to say thanks very much for watching please like comment subscribe facebook and instagram links are in the description please go like that page follow there and you'll see all my new videos coming up there if you aren't happen to be on youtube and uh yeah, you are on there. You'll see my new video, so you can go watch it. And once again, thanks everyone who subscribed, liked, and supported me so far. This is only the beginning, guys, and my leg will get better, and all my lifts will go up, and my size will go up, and then eventually I'll cut and get shredded. So, yeah, guys, so once again, thanks very much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye for now.